Tim. We're here at TDT Machine Tool Client in the north of England, and it's another double column style machine. Yeah, it's, uh, it's just completing installation. We we're just doing the final uh, commissioning today of the Renishaw probe. So just about ready to hand over to the customer. And it's a very large machine. You know, what is the size? Uh, this machine's a, a CAFO KMC 3127, so we've got a 3 metre by 2.7 metre travelling table. Um, it's got uh, 700 millimetres in the Z axis, and it's got a couple of options there 5 degree indexing head as well as the, the vertical spindle. And I know this, this client, you know, it's quite a secretive client, but why did they go for your machine? I think they were looking at uh, improving their uh, cycle times on the components. Uh, one of the uh, things that we've offered with the machine is some techno-magnetic uh, magnetic clamping system, so we can clamp the workpieces very quickly. Um, the cycle time is quite small, but because of the rigidity of the machine, we can get the benefit of some quick work holding and some, uh, some good machining. And in terms of the machine tool, can you talk us, you know, let's go into a bit more detail, what, you know, what's the construction, you know, yeah, t tell us the details. Well, the, the CAFO machines are a particularly well-built machine. They, they are um, heavily constructed. All the castings, it's cast iron construction. All the castings are generous. Um, we seem to think uh, they're probably a little bit bigger than our competitors, so we do get very good rigidity. Um, there's a lot of advanced engineering in the machine. The ball screws, for instance, are all internally cooled. We have a two-speed gearbox. Uh, we can offer good torque and good spindle speed. And like you say, you've got integrated uh, Renishaw probing. Is, is the whole installation being dealt with by TDT Machine Tools? Yeah, we offer the full turnkey. Um, we've, uh, we've been involved with the foundations, obviously offloading the machine, installing the machine. We have some specialist machinery handlers who did that for us. And then our engineers have been and um, finished off the installation. And I know that this type of machine, it's not something you'd stock in your showroom. So from when, when the inquiry was placed, how was that journey to, to get to where we are now? Well, obviously, on an inquiry like this, it's, it is a very technical uh, discussion initially on the, on the application. Um, we started probably back in uh, early April. Um, the machine was ordered just uh, beginning of May, so delivered here, as I say, three or four weeks ago. So, it's, yeah, it's been around eight months from start to finish. That's good, though, isn't it? Quite often we hear these stories. You can be waiting a couple of years for a machine of this size. Yeah, well, CAFO, they, they, they are quite a... a, a established manufacturer they manufacture somewhere in the order of 40 of these machines every month so obviously they have a, a program of machines going through the uh, stock build program so depending on the final specification we can we can generally offer some very you know quick deliveries and tdt machine tools you look after a lot of you know well established brands but the kfu it seems to be going really well what why is this i think generally they're, they're very well built machines and they offer great value for money um, yeah it's uh, you look at the machine it looks they look good and they, they do exactly you know what people expect them to do. And these double collar machines, this is probably the fourth or fifth I've seen this year. So again, why this style? Well I think the, the big advantage of this is that it's a relatively compact machine for the um, size of the table and also because of the double column, the bridge construction, they are very, very rigid. Many in the pipeline, are we going to see some more? Yeah, we've got quite a lot of interesting queries at the minute across the a range of sectors, tool and mould, obviously general engineering um, and also um, some high speed applications. And just finally, the Techno Magneti, we, we, we can't leave here without talking about that. You know, it, that's quite a small component on there, but I know some of the components that this manufacturer makes are going to be huge. So to pull it on with magnets, just tell our viewers the advantages. Yeah, well, the big advantage with magnetic uh, work holding uh, uh, is that you get a very, very secure clamp a lot of clamping force. I know people are very sceptical about it because you can't see any clamps, but typically the, 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 the chuck that's on there we can offer somewhere in the region of 41 tonnes clamping force. So the, the clamping force is massive and that gives a big advantage again of, of being able to use the rigidity of the machine. And components that are regular, that doesn't matter, does it, if it's a forging or a casting? No, we can, we can offer um, a range of poles and that go on top of the magnetic surface, some of which are um, movable, so they can take up any undulations on castings, etc. Yeah, that's... And the head, again, we can't leave here without talking about the head. It's a large head, you know. You know, they make their own heads, don't they, at KFU? Yeah, all the, the heads are manufactured internally in CAFO. The This one, as I say, is a five-degree five degree indexing head. Uh, 6,000 6, RPM, um, 728 Newton metres of torque, so yeah, they, they offer good performance.
Yeah, it's a well spec machine and I, I look forward to seeing many more. Yeah, well, let's hope we can, uh, you know, build on the success we've had already.